Hello, it's the Haunt Informer, and today I'm talking about why haunted houses are using silicon masks more often. So today I am telling you why haunted houses are starting to use silicon masks more nowadays. And I have how to put on a silicon mask tutorial, and I'll have a link to that in the corner of this video. So today I'm telling you why the haunted houses are using silicon masks more. And the really the big reason why is because it takes a lot less time to get actors ready. And some haunts have small casts. Sometimes they have like 20 actors. Other haunts that are bigger have like 50 to 70. And some really huge haunts have 100 actors, like 200 or 300 that they have to get ready every night. And they only have a few hours to get them all ready so it's a lot easier for them to take them all get their costume get a silicone mask just have them put that on and that goes with their character and that is their character and that expresses all the artistic representation of the character they want for the actor to act upon and show to the audience in just a few mere seconds. Silicone mask does not take very long to put on, you just have to be careful not to rip it, and in my video I talk about that. There are full head silicone masks and there are half mask slash hood masks. And full head silicone mask, the, you have a face and the back of your head is covered with the mask and there's a bib that goes down to here on your chest. Those are way definitely more than the half mask. The half mask just the face and the back. Now, other half masks are also just the face, which is the strap that keeps it on. And there's other ones that are silicon half masks that have a face and they're held on by a Under Armour looking hood that you can put on. So there's multiple variations. And you can choose which silicone mask you want in your scene. So haunts may, if you're in an area that is darker, but they still want that effect of a scary creature or character that they want with a high amount of detail that they don't want to spend hours on on makeup they just get a silicone half mask and have a detailed face and just not have the back of the mask be detailed so that is the big reason why silicone masks are being used more in haunts overall it's because it just speeds up the preparation process for the haunt itself and makes it a lot easier on the artists that are there because if they know people everywhere can work a lot better together because the person that's dealing with the mask and giving them to the actors and they know which ones go to which characters it's a lot more effective when they can just be like here you go you're ready here's your mask your character is ready just put this on and you're ready and of course they teach them how to put them on and then that character's done they are ready and then they can take they still only have a limited amount of time to get the makeups done but then they can f some artists like one artist in particular you could say could possibly spend more time on a makeup because they're not worried about having seven other actors they have to get ready they could spend more time and make a particular makeup that they want done really well and detail that's going to be in a bright area they can spend more time on that so it's really good for everybody and it's all to give a better more realistic experience for you the customers and that's what haunts try to do give the most immersive scary experience they can that was the haunt informer i hope you enjoyed subscribe and I am on Twitter now. My Twitter handle is at Han Informer. Say it again, at Han Informer. And on Instagram, my name is Haunt underscore Informer. Say it again, Haunt underscore Informer. On Facebook, I am The Haunt Informer. Say it again, The Haunt Informer. And as always, happy hauntings.